Hi guys, so today I'm going to share with you all my skincare routine. Now this is something I do in the morning and in the night, a few steps here and there. And I'm going to quickly run through that with you guys so you all will have um, a nice idea of some good products that I now totally rely on. Especially these three products that I've been loving these past couple of weeks and have worked wonders for my skin. So I'm going to now zoom you guys in and let's get right into the video. Hello to my zoomed in face. So the first thing I'm going to do is get rid of all of this from in front of my face. So I just have a hair tie right here and I'm going to put it into a bun on the top of my head that might actually cut out a shot with it. Yup, it does. Anyway, that's okay. I was just looking at my viewfinder. Now I'm actually sharing with you all my more of a nighttime routine that I do because um, in the day I don't have to get makeup off because obviously it's the morning but I do use some products in the morning which I will mention through the video. Now earlier to remove my makeup the one thing I would use was this. This is the Garnier Micellar Water. I either use this or I use Bioderma. Whichever I like, really like both. And the cotton pads that I've been using are these. These are the mini so bleach free cotton pads. So I usually would just get some of this on a cotton pad, hold it down, wipe my face. So today I'm not going to be using a cotton pad and micellar water. I'm actually going to be use, using this. This is the makeup eraser that I picked up at Sephora and I know you can get it here now. So I'm going to leave that link down below. Um, it's really nice. There's a smooth side which is this side of the cloth and then there is an uneven side. And uh, you basically, they're just like exfoliating. This side exfoliates, this, this, the other side cleanses. It just pulls all of your makeup off. All you have to do is get it wet and that's it. Now I usually do this in, at my wash basin but I'm not going to do that there because I want to show you guys how I do it. So I actually have a bowl of water right here that I'm going to use so give me a second. So I just have this bowl of water right here that I'm actually going to use to dampen the cloth and get rid of my makeup. So you just dampen the cloth like really get it wet. Then all you got to do guys is wipe. So I'm just wiping. I can feel all my makeup come off like I literally makeup on this you guys it's that easy and then you just dump this into a washing machine and you're good to go so I'm now going to quickly show you guys how this gets my eye makeup off if you can see I just have a little nothing too much today but this also gets glitter makeup off most of the time Now I'm going to just get my lipstick off, so I'm just going to use the same thing, dampen it, and just wipe it off. It's that good, like I remember when I bought this and I showed it to my friends and they were like, that's the thing you should be getting us. Now I'm just going to use the opposite, the other side which is a little rough, dampen that and exfoliate my face with this. So all you have to do is circular motions. as you can see that's most of my makeup completely gone through my face and I literally that's all I do to get makeup off usually if I have a really thick layer of makeup I might still use a little micellar water which is what I'm going to do right now to show you guys if there's any makeup left on my face so grab a cotton pad the usual micellar water soak that in usually there's a little uh, residue left on your face but not a lot so wiping my face down nothing literally nothing like no makeup at all the only thing that usually remains is some mascara if you're wearing a really strong mascara so then I use this to just get that off but also that also not a lot today which is insane so because I like to double cleanse I don't just use the makeup uh, eraser or micellar to clean my face I also wash my face now this is almost over but if you can see this is the Neutrogena deep clean facial clean cleanser for normal to oily skin and I use this to wash my face um, I have really sensitive skin like some products do not work well with my skin so I have to be very careful with what I use but this has been fantastic clears my face really nice my face feels clean so what I'm gonna do is now go wash my face with this and I'll be right back so I'm back I just use this to wash my face now the next thing that I'm gonna do is get my three step into my routine now these are the products that I've been talking about it's the Riceramide Ridge from Face Shop I've actually been loving this so this is the toner the emulsion and the moisturizer I've been using these three every day in the morning and the evening 
so I'm gonna first start with the toner. A lot of people put it on their cotton pad. I really think the cotton a cotton pad soaks up quite a bit of product. So I literally take it directly on my hands, just a couple drops. You don't need more than that. And I just dab it onto my face and then I just rub it in. The next thing that I use is the emulsion. So I'm just gonna grab some of that again, just a couple drops on my fingers. Honestly, that's all that you need. So I just get some of that. Now this is something that I've been doing on a daily, morning and night. So, and I've been really seeing a difference in my skin. My skin feels a lot brighter. It's cleared up like the little spots that I had, which has been fantastic. Uh, and of course, then I add the moisturizer. So I just get a little of it on my ring finger and dab that onto my face. Also, if y'all can hear some outside sounds, it's the rain. It just started pouring and then there's rain crashing against my window. So if y'all can hear that, it's the rain. Also, if the light has changed, it is the rain. So that is usually my moisturizing routine. Now, if this, if I'm doing this in the morning, uh, then I actually add this to my skin after, which is an oil-free moisture with sunscreen. The only reason I add it is because it's sunscreen. And some days when I don't want to use this, I just add this, but I usually put this on because it's sunscreen. And then I get my makeup on, but if I this is before I go to sleep, I do that. And then I get some Vaseline on. Now, in the nights, I put on so much of this, and I just let it be like a mask on my lips because it really moisturizes. In the day, if I need to wear a lipstick soon after, I actually don't do that, but I get some of this on. This is the Birch Bees Honey Lip Balm. I absolutely love it. It moisturizes the lips really nicely, and that's what I'm going to use now. I'm not going to put on some Vaseline, so just some of this. And the last thing I do in my nighttime routine is get some hand cream on. Now, this is the uh, Bath & Body Works Sheer Butter Cucumber Melon Hand Cream. So, I literally, it's almost over actually. So, so I just get some of this on my hands. And that's it you guys. That's my nighttime routine. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You all know what you all have to do. Like, share, subscribe and I will see you all next time. Bye.